Hi guys and welcome back to another video. Today is a very, very special day. Uh, I'm sure you could hear it in my voice. I'm very excited about this. Um, but yeah, today we finally get to put the trunk on the AUG, making the AUG my most powerful assault rifle. Uh, so without further ado, let's get right into doing that. Uh, the trunk costs 22,820 coins or dollars uh, and that is a lot of money, if you're going to be honest. Um, and I have 22,833, so I only have 13 more than what is required. And as you can see, I'm only left with 13 now. Um, but yeah, when the trunk is equipped, actually, let's take off everything and look at the stats and then look at the stats once uh, everything I have is equipped. And we'll see what's different. We'll see if it's better, if it's worse uh, in some areas. So yeah, looking at the AUG uh, without any modifications, it has the stats of 29 damage, 230 accuracy, fire rate of 6.2, holder of 30 rounds, and total ammo of 150. Uh, looking at this weapon, it doesn't look all that impressive if you look at it initially. The only thing that looks quite impressive for assault weapon is the accuracy. 230 is really, really nice, and it's uh, up there for assault weapons, as I said, uh, as I pointed out. Um, but its damage is pretty low and its fire rate is really quite low as well for uh, assault weapon. Assault weapons are uh, usually pretty fast um, and this is toward the lower end of the spectrum I'd, I'd want to say. Um, but yeah, and with that being said, once the modifications are added, uh, I don't have a sight yet so it's not technically fully modified but it is in the aspect that uh, anything that affects stats is completely boosted uh, and here we go, let's throw them all back on here. So the modifications I have are the silencer number three, the flashlight, and the speed mag or the fast clip. Uh, and the stats for uh, stats of this weapon uh, with those modifications are uh, 37 damage, 228 accuracy, 7.8 fire rate, holder of 30 runs, and total ammo of 150 once again. Uh, the damage is greatly, greatly bo boosted by the modifications I added. Uh, accuracy is not that, uh, did not get lowered that much at all. It only came down by 2 uh, and went from 200. 30 to 228 which is absolutely amazing i'm so excited about that and then fire rate went up uh, about two points i want to say to 7.8 still not the quickest assault weapon um but uh better nonetheless uh so let's stop talking let's equip this weapon and see how it actually performs the last time i tested this weapon out i was not that impressed with it it was really slow it required a lot of shots to get a kill without the trunk uh so i was like this probably was ranked my fourth or fifth best assault weapon and that's actually pretty low i ranked it below the m4 the ak the scar uh and the famas so it was my fifth weapon uh and that's actually pretty bad considering how much I spent on it. But now that it is fully modified, it should perform better. It is super accurate, as you could see, uh, and its damage should be very high as well. It is it has more damage than both uh, the uh, FAMAS and the AK, which have uh, damage of 36 each. Uh, this has damage of 37, so it takes down the opponent with three shots to the body. Really, really nice. Uh, I like the power of this gun now. Still a little bit slow for my uh, opinion, for my taste, but yeah, I like it uh, so far. It's not bad. Let's see how we get, uh, how it performs over mid distance as well. Wow, that shot came in from afar. As you can see, still really, really accurate, uh, and I love the accuracy of this weapon. It's very similar to the FAMAS, I want to say. The FAMAS is very accurate, just like this weapon. Wow, that guy came out of nowhere, and he stole my gun. Um, but yeah, uh, the FAMAS is very similar to this weapon when it comes to accuracy. They're both very accurate, even over uh, medium distances, and that's the reason I like them so much. Uh, I'm definitely liking this weapon a little bit more since uh, the trunk has been added. Definitely could see uh, the damage has been increased largely um, by in, uh, adding a trunk to this weapon and i think it might be ranked maybe my third favorite now uh i like it a little bit more probably even more than my m4 which is ranked my fourth favorite weapon uh it goes scar ak uh famas 
M4 in this, and now this comes before the M4 because it because it has so much power, um, and the power definitely makes up for the lack of speed, uh, and the ricochet is far less because of the lack of speed as well. So, uh, yeah, this gun is very nicely balanced. I like it much more than I did. Uh, still love my FAMAS and AK and SCAR before this weapon, but those weapons are really, really hard to top. Um, obviously, this weapon is more accurate than the FAMAS and uh, the SCAR, I want to say. No, the AK and the SCAR. Uh, it's about as accurate or maybe a little bit more accurate than the FAMAS. So if you really love accuracy, this is probably the way to go. Um, but as I said, you're going to have to compromise a lot of uh, speed for that accuracy. If you want speed, go for the SCAR. If you want damage, go for this weapon. Uh, if you want accuracy uh, and damage, uh, I would go for the FAMAS because that's a bit quicker than this weapon. Uh, it's about as accurate and a little bit low in, lower in damage. Uh, but I think overall, uh, the speed of the FAMAS gets quicker kills uh, because it's like two, two points quicker than this uh, and has roughly uh, the same stats everywhere else compared to this weapon. So uh, it just comes... Uh, a, uh, it just comes to what your preferences are. Uh, I prefer a quicker weapon, but this is pretty damn quick over longer distances. Uh, considering how accurate it is, considering how accurate it is, uh, it is plenty quick, and I could definitely see myself using this weapon in my everyday rotations. But yeah, guys, that's about all I have to say. I'm just gonna. Get a couple more kills and wrap up this video. I didn't want it to be too long. I just wanted to show you guys me buying the trunk. And hopefully I will buy, buy a site for this weapon as well. Uh, and I'll record a video once I do that. But uh, for now, this gun is technically fully modified. And I'm pretty impressed with it. Uh, it exceeds my expectations when it comes to accuracy uh, and damage. I was not expecting to get killed with three body shots. I was thinking more four, uh, but yeah, it's really, really nice. I like it, uh, and I'll use it a little bit more and see how I feel about it, um, but so far, I'm really liking it, and uh, yeah, that's about it, guys. If you enjoyed this video, hit that thumbs up button. If you like the type of content in general, hit that subscribe button as well as the post notification bell, but other than that, I will let you go. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I hope you have an amazing day.